is what we're doing, guys. All right, this is what we're doing. We've got to scramble up way through that tightest gap over there for one and a half difficulty. J cash. Madness, man. But it was fun. Really enjoyed it. If you're new here, everyone, please remember subscribe to the channel. That'd be absolutely awesome. Don't cost you nothing to subscribe and uh, hit that notification bell for all our geocaching uploads and walks we do in really cool places. And just to show you, come across things like this. Hi everyone and welcome back to Imondo Family Adventures. So today we are carrying on our walk along the coastline heading back down to the lifeboat station where we have one adventure lab to complete and then we're going to go and check out the lighthouse and between doing this we've got a few physical geocaches to find. So we'll, we'll get that done and get this finished and then on another day, which is getting towards the end of our break in this part of France, we'll be heading over to Peros Grec uh, before we then move on to another part of France. So I hope you enjoy it, everyone, and let's get on with it. Let's cash on, guys. I'll show you from a different angle. This little area. We was up there last time, next to the house. I thought I'd take a photo of this guys, look at the bullet holes in the side of there. Alright, so we've made it around to the uh, lifeboat station. And the lighthouse in the distance. Okay, so we've got a geocache where that lighthouse is, where there's lots of people. So, since the time of recording, I've done, we've done two adventure labs and one geocache, physical geocache. But it's so busy around now that we're going to go and try and find the other geocache over there and I might not be able to record it again. Please sit right there. Okay. It's the right, Jasmine. Nope. It's in this lot. 
Right, let's get across here. Stay in the middle, Jazz. Stay in the middle. See this little chapel thing here, Mark? Can you get over here? Stay me, stay there. Jazz, me, stay there. Like an old lamp. Yeah, that's the life though. My children stay there. Literally sit there. Yeah, the lifeboat's going out and the lifeboat's going out somewhere. It's not going full speed though. Look at the rocks here guys. Look at the rocks here guys. Uh, maybe. Hmm. What's your head on that? That's good on camera. Yeah. <sighs> so I reckon it's is it over that way somewhere? Alright. Yeah. Oh, I'll say it's not gonna be out the light house, is it? I like how the lighthouse is made of the granite. Oh. Okay, so the geocache is around here somewhere, but it could be anywhere. It could be absolutely anywhere. Forty four. Right, let's be careful here, guys, because it's muddy. So. Yeah, it's done. What are you eating? This is surprising. You're not going in there, it's dead end. Hey, Dan. We have to go this way. The rating's way lower than it should be. This one was super tough. I think it's harder than some of the other ones we've done, to be honest. Oh, okay. I want to go in it. I want to go on the lid. put that on the lid for me, please. Yeah, so we're over that side of the rocks over there. And we had to go all the way around, clamber over the rocks to get to it around here. Which was not easy. <laughs> you two go stand over there for a photo, guys. Alright, this is what we're doing. We've had to scramble all the way through that tightest gap over there for one and a half difficulty. J Cash. Madness, man. But it was fun. Really enjoyed it. So, what the bloody hell was Show some weight, Lewis. You be really careful there. We just scrambled up along this edge here to get out from one of them rocks down there. Mental. Oh man, that was a geocache challenge. Bigger challenge than we thought. What are we filming here?
Okay, so we're on Geocache 3146. Um, after that really difficult one at the lighthouse, we then did a, an easy one, but it was seriously busy. Seriously busy on the road. So we're backtracked now, um, away from the main hub of people to do another one on this um, little country lane. Okay, so we've just found another Jekash. That was um, a high difficulty rating, but it was actually really easy to find. So, yeah. that's another one done. And now we're going to go and possibly do one more today. If we can find it. And then maybe stop and let the kids go for a swim. So now we're going to another geocache that's got a train difficulty of four. So we'll see if it's doable or not. I can say the um, train and difficulty levels have been a bit mixed. We had one that was really hard but had an easy difficulty rating. And we had one that was easy that had a hard difficulty rating. So you never know what you're going to get. But we can see a massive rock in the distance. So we're all thinking that might be where we're going. Gash is around this area somewhere. Hopefully it's not right at the top of that rock. <laughs> but, you know, it may well be. I just had a big cobweb hit me in the face. Crazy. <laughs> I don't know how, when, they, when they've all walked off in front of me. <sighs> oh no! Uh, difficulty four guys. Not easy to find. I've got it. I've got it. Good one, that. Good one. Right. Get yourself, right. guys. And we've got to make his way back now. So that's that deer cache done. Oh, clambering all around the rock. Get the view. It's not an easy one, guys. So that's probably going to end it for today. If I see anything else cool, I'll show you. So I hope you enjoyed this one today. Loads of geocaches found. Awesome day. And we'll see you again soon for more. Thank you and goodbye.